We're absolutely delighted that AccuCensus have chosen Devon and Cornwall Police and the Vision Zero partnership to work with on this, this innovative new technology. We know who we uh, arrest and charge for drink driving and drug driving. What we don't know is how prevalent it is on our road network. And I think what this will do is will give us intelligence around the levels of potential impairment. We've got to pilot the latest innovative new technologies that are out there. And we're delighted this is the first time in the world that it's being deployed. And then we're going to use the power of AI to look at huge amounts of data so that they can spend more efficient time at the side of the road talking to a driver and then making their own decision about whether they want to test for impairment. So tonight we have the world first uh, trial of some new camera technology. So using AI technology, we've got cameras that are, are down there, uh, further down the road, uh, and they are looking at people's driving and potentially um, people that are impaired are being flagged on screen. Well, we know that impaired driving through alcohol or drugs is one of the fatal five, so one of the five main causes of uh, uh, fatal and serious road traffic collisions across the country. So it is something we need to be focusing on. It's a high harm issue. Um, the reason we're looking at it now is that we have to be open to embracing new approaches. You know, AI is, is, is providing so much worth now in our lives professionally and, and personally. Um, these cameras aren't being seen as replacing the role of a police officer or staff member in any way, it's just a different way of identifying the risk potentially. Drink driving causes a measurable harm on our road networks and this is purely about say changing behaviours and, and saying to people we are developing new capabilities to detect if you've been drinking and driving.